Hey everybody, Zero here. Um, I uh, wanted to do a video comparing the two colors of the 3DS to help if you're maybe trying to pick one up and you don't know which color you wanted to get. So I'm going to go over like the exact differences that um, the two colors have. This is my black system that I did an unboxing for. Um, and then I picked up the other system, the aqua blue. Uh, this is the Cosmo Black. Um, picked up the, the blue last night and it was dark so I didn't want to make a video for it um, didn't really need to do an unboxing for it because it would have been the same as the black one but um, I'm going to do a comparison now of the colors now this is the weird thing because the black one shows up perfectly on camera this is exactly what the black one looks like in real life and you know I'm looking through my camera lens here and it shows up fine now the strange thing is the blue one I'm going to bring it here into the shot this is not actually what the blue one looks like, um, what you're seeing on camera here. As I look at it in real life, like, you know, with my eyes, not through the camera, it's actually a much more um, greenish shade of blue, like a very deep, like, turquoise, um, marine, sea foam kind of color. But for some reason, I tried last night with my cell phone camera, my actual camera, my, um, my iPod, no matter what lens I seem to look through, it distorts the color and makes it more of a muted uh, baby blue. Not sure why it's doing that, so this isn't going to be exactly a accurate representation of the color, but I'll try to show you as best as I can what some of the differences are. Now, I don't know if you'll be able to see this on the camera, but with the black one, um, it's more of a dark jet black on the bottom where the cameras are. And then about halfway through, I don't know if you can see that, there's kind of a line where it starts to fade. And then the top part is more of a lighter uh, grayish color. Um, and it's also speckled, which you can't start to see the speckles until until the lighter color. Because this is pretty much pitch black down here. Um, now on both of the 3DSs, the color is actually underneath. The, the plastic is underneath and then there's like a clear coat of plastic over it that protects it so that you won't lose the color. Um, so I'm not sure if the speckled design is on the paint itself underneath or if it's on the clear plastic. Um, but, yeah, there's it's like dark and then it fades about halfway. Um, now it does the same thing on the blue one, I believe. You just can't tell because um, the blue one is a lighter color and it's much more reflective. So you don't really see the, um, you don't really see that dark color and then a light color it's pretty consistent all the way across and it's also if you look in the black one you can see a little bit of a reflection but it's kind of foggy and it's not very reflective the blue one on the other hand is like a mirror you can look in it and you can see everything clearly um i don't know why that is but uh yeah it's very 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 reflective i believe it also is sparkly like the uh the black one but you can't really tell once again um, it, it's colors more smooth so now let's open the systems up actually no let's do the bottoms first okay so the bottom of the black one has a very metallic um, sparkly light gray color and the bottom of the blue once again the camera's not showing it um, accurately this is actually supposed to look like a very very green color even more so than the top um, it's it's much lighter though um, it's supposed to be a very very light like sea foam color um, and it's not sparkly it's just smooth plastic whereas you can see how this is all grainy looking that's because it's got sparkles um, if you flip these over and look at the sides let's see if I can do both of them if you look at the sides, the middle section, which is also the back hinge, um, is kind of in between colors on both of them. Uh, it's a little bit more noticeable on the blue because you have light, medium, and dark. On the black it's the same way. You can see that this is light. This is supposed to be medium and dark, but you can't really tell much of a difference between the middle section and the top section. So now I'm going to open them up so you can see what the insides look like and compare them. Turn the volume down on that. 
and open this one, turn the volume down on that. Alright. Sorry, it's, it is morning, so there's sun coming in the window, but for some reason it's getting really dark over here. Okay, so. And for the third time, the color is not being accurately represented here. This is coming out as a much more muted baby blue. It's actually a very, very bright, vivid turquoise color. Um, now, both top screens are black. That's how it's going to be on any 3DS that comes out, because they say that the black color makes it easier on your eyes when you're looking at the 3D. I guess it would be more confusing or it would hurt your eyes if this was a bright color up here. So, top screen is always going to have black around it. Now, on this system, obviously, black on top, black on bottom. Uh, the only thing that's not is the gray analog nub. And uh, over here, everything's blue. Um, so, yeah, I don't know why it's so dark in here. I'm going to back up a little bit. And I really wish that it did come through as the proper color on the camera, but for some strange reason it just doesn't. Um, you have the, uh, the sparkly uh, lighter blue showing through here uh, from the back, or from the, uh, that's the hinge? Yeah, so that's it's the same color as, as this part. Um, but yeah, I mean obviously both systems are the same, just two different colors but there's a lot of people out there that if they're gonna spend two hundred and fifty dollars they you know want to get the color that they like so I just wanted to show you some of the um, the differences um, fingerprints show up a little bit more on the blue one just because the color is so light the black one they do show up a little bit just because it's a very um, smooth plasticky material so you can see the fingerprints on it but not quite as much um, on the top screen on both of them you can see the fingerprints pretty easily um, but they do wipe off, and the nice thing is that unlike the uh, Cobalt and Crimson DS lights, where the paint was just on top of black plastic, the there's a clear coating of plastic that covers the color on both these, so you won't be able to chip off the paint. So, But that's the uh, comparison for the two 3DS colors, and I hope you guys uh, enjoyed it and were able to make a decision on which one you wanted to get. Alright, see you guys.